So there's a video on um, TMZ of Chad Ocho Cinco Johnson, whatever you guys call him nowadays, of him. He he slapped the lawyer's butt and the judge got mad. And so now that the he's I think she gave yeah she gave him like thirty days in jail. And so the judge you like the judge she's just. She really needed, all three things she needed was a chill pill, a relaxer, and to take a joke. Because even if the man wasn't even joking, he just, like, he didn't even, like, playfully smack the lawyer's butt. He just, like, smacked the lawyer's butt. Because you know, like, how football players, when they get, like, a certain amount of yards, inception, interception, or um, touchdown. I'm taking, I don't know how it takes me a while to think of that, but a touchdown. But she, like, he did that, and football players usually do that. I'm pretty sure he's, like, done it to just more than, like, lawyers. And the lawyer was a guy, so she shouldn't really trip that much about it. Like, if it was a girl, then yeah, but, like, even if, like, well, I don't know. If it was, like, if it was a girl, it would, like, seem, because maybe if it was, like, a manly girl, like, a big buff manly girl, then yeah, but... Anyways, like, she straight up tripped for no reason. She gave him, like, 30 days. They were almost done. They were that close to being finished. And then next thing you know, she gave, as soon as it was maybe a few minutes later, because, like, a couple of people left in the courtroom, and she thought that he was joking around and things. But he was being really serious. And out of nowhere, she just flipped out and was like, I don't think you're taking this serious right now. And he was like, I am being serious, lady. And so she was uh, like, well, I'm not accepting these papers. And I think it was his, like, probation papers or something. I don't know. But she didn't accept the papers. She gave them back. And I was like, wow, that's that was kind of cold on her part. Because you got mad because he, he's doing something that he usually does, like, all the time when he's playing football. Like, I'm pretty sure if you, like, put a whole football team in there and they all did that, are you going to give everybody in there 30 days? Because I'm pretty sure if you had done that, then that had been like, that's like, that's like a little controversy thing because I'm not going to use that word again. I didn't even say that word. But anyways, that's like going to stick down in history because of like what she did and things. And so hopefully them 30 days just goes by really quick for him. And that judge gets what she gets because that was really wrong on her part to give the man 30 days. One day would have been good, but 30 days, come on now. You, you're you acting like this man this is like the first time him doing something like that. To a lawyer, yes. Pretty sure he probably did to his lawyer before and his lawyer was okay with it. But if like if it was like she should ask the lawyer first, are you okay with him doing that? And then if he would say yes... Then she should just went on, accepted the papers, and then boom, they had been done. But then she just was all like, you people are laughing, you're joking around. It's like, don't like blame somebody for something that they already do. Because if they already doing it, then that's like, that's just basically being, uh, like, I can't think of the word for it. But there's a word out there, and whatever that word is, that's what I'm saying and so, like, that's like if she did something that judges usually do, and that's like somebody jumping on your case about it. She just thinks that she's, like, since she's the judge, she can do whatever she wants. But remember, there's just more than you out there. There's other people that has different opinions, like me, because what I think that she should have not given him anymore. Like, she's just going to go put him in there for 30 days now. And so hopefully he gets out soon, maybe like a little early dismissal type thing or something, I don't know. But what that judge did, I find it to be really stupid.